What's it like going down a class three rapid in a Sea Eagle? It's fun. It's really fun. Hey, my name is Jan Wilson. I own four Sea Eagles just like this. And pound for pound, I don't think you can get a better product. We've gone down Cache Creek. We've gone down East Fork of the Carson. We've gone down the South Fork of the American. And right now we're going down the Russian River and it's swollen, it's flood stage. Woo, Russian River! I've been camping on this thing. My tent, my stove back here. Got my pump up here, water, food. Probably go out camping for at least a week. A few of my friends uh, do hard shell kayaking. The reason I've stuck with inflatable kayaks is because with a hard shell you have to wear a helmet, you have to have a spray skirt, you have to learn how to do an Eskimo roll. Plus I can carry a lot more gear. They can't carry any camping gear. In the summertime it's 100 degrees out there. I've seen other people with other brands, the seams pop. They, they literally wilt in the sun. The seagull's made of some kind of material that just seems to defy a hot sun. The Sea Eagle 330 is a very inexpensive way for a family to have fun. One of the reasons I like inflatable kayaks so much over hard shells or canoes is because once I deflate this thing, I can just roll them up, put them in a bag. It's very airport friendly. You can travel with it. You could put as many as four or five in the back of your trunk. Hard shells, you've got to get a rack for your car. Canoes, you've got to get a rack for your car. This is another reason I like uh, inflatable kayaks is because they're very forgiving. These inflatable kayaks just bounce right off the rock. My advice for anyone wanting to get into kayaking for the first time is to just go to seagull.com, check out their beginning packages, and buy one of these crafts. You will not regret it. Pound for pound, this is the best inflatable kayak you can buy on the market, without a doubt.